these are the propellers for the underwater remotely operated vehicle. It allows the it allows the vehicle to move forward by giving it a thrust force. The bar allows the gripper to move upwards or downwards. The piston rod is screwed onto the bar to allow the gripper to move left and right. The pump of the gripper moves along the piston rod to allow the gripper to open or close. The front part of the remotely operated vehicle is curved to allow it to have less water resistance or buoyant force when it moves forward underwater. There will be two hollow areas for the body. To sink, this area will fill up with water. To float, this area will lose water. There will be compressed air to push the water out when it needs to float. The body is made by steel while the propeller and the fingers are made from aluminum. The reason we picked aluminum for the gripper is because it's lightweight and it's strong. And the reason we picked steel for the body is because of the gripper hanging on the bottom of the body. 